critical depth or any other depth. We just we just use critical depth as an example. What what could be the what could be the uh, solution? For no, for both side. Let's let's talk about both side. If you are the bank, if you are the bank, what kind of solution could be available for you? And if you are the debtor, your own money, what kind of solution for you could be? Okay, let's focus on lender first. Okay, let's divide it half and half. Let, yeah, yeah, all right. For starters, like a payment plan. <coughs> yes, let's talk about let's focus on the, the bank first. So then we switch to the to the borrower. See what kind of solution could be. Okay, maybe we'll, we'll figure out what kind. And also, we'll talk about what what will be the legal protection. What will be the legal protection for the borrower? Okay, by the way, wow, the situation is very strange. Okay, that the law even on the side of the borrower. Can you believe it? Yeah. So let's focus on the lender first. Okay, if you are the lender, you're the bank. What kind of uh, solution may be available? You can lower the interest rate. Yes. Let's talk about it. Okay, before default, let's not go to the default yet. Okay. Mm -hmm. Say you are the borrower and you just want to fulfill your duty to repay. However, you are all already encounter your financial difficulty. But you don't want to default, you just try your best, very, very hard, at least to maintain. And as a borrower, what 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 can you do? And probably this mirror side with the the bank. If the bank would like to help you out, and the bank, you know, does not want to see the bad debt, uncollectable debt, and before you go to the default, default means no payment. Okay, totally no payment. What can these people do? Pay restructuring. Yeah, pay minimum. Pay minimum, right? You know, the bank always provide this opportunity. To say, this is your balance here. Another number is very small number, right? Mm -hmm. Minimum payment. As long as you meet this minimum payment, you are okay. You are not deemed as a default. But what's the problem with minimum payment? At least the two problems. If you want to meet the minimum payment, there are at least the two problems for debt. What? Interest high. Yeah, interest is very high usually. But depends. Sometimes right now, I still see the bank charge you like a four ninety nine, four point ninety nine say 5% interest rate, but sometimes raise out to 29 mm -hmm. Right, interest rate, but reflect to you, to this situation, what problem could be? There are two they major problems. They will use your credit card. Right? right, they will reduce your unused credit line. Say you, before you have, uh, say, $5,000 now credit, and right now you only owe $1,000. You Eventually you have $4,000 credit line, you may be able to use it before but however once you get into the minimum payment plan already usually the bank is not the bank it's computer okay everything is programming okay the computer will program your account and drop your balance usually automatically of course you can try to negotiate with the manager say hey we, right now i'm really in need okay I'm really in need, and the, the manager will say, well, you, you are already in the, the minimum payment already. We don't believe you, you're going to be able to pay back if you owe more. So the number one issue is they're going to cut down your unused uh, line of credit, un unused line. Another problem, they cut down, cut down already, cut down from 5000 to 1000 The 1000 is whatever you owe. They really mean for this account, you have no more credit you can use. So under this situation, the number two issue is usually this borrow got into the situation is uh, probably may never able to pay back the whole balance if if he or she follow out the minimum payment unless on one day he or she can pay back everything. Otherwise, if just maintain the minimum payment, they really mean probably not even sufficient to cover the interest. So you can see the balance is gonna accumulate bigger and bigger. There's another problem. And the number three issue is once the people, a lot of people, it's not worth this. 
once the people got into the minimum payment situation, the credit score already dropped. We are not talking about a default. Okay? Minimum payment is not default. All right? At least between you and the bank, you maintain the minimum payment, you're still paying something. But once the people got into the minimum payment situation, the credit score start to drop. Start to drop. Not very seriously, not really severely, but the score really drop. Score drop means you lose your opportunity to apply for the new credit card new loan you already so the situation getting worse and worse right because you know if, if you think about say 10 years ago golden day right and during that period usually people receive the uh, advertising in the mail say hey you got a five thousand dollars credit approved and uh, for the first year say zero balance zero interest that, that's very very common advertising 10 years ago and people just transfer your existing balance to the new account and enjoy the zero, right? But no more, no more. So once this person got into this minimum payment uh, situation, everything gonna be deteriorate, deteriorate, okay? Okay, then let's talk about default. So if this person default, uh, if you work for the bank, how can you do? Okay. We have one suggest, right? Can go into the, uh, the new plan Yeah, talk about your, your solution from the bank. Like the payment plan? Yes, payment plan. Yeah, is, there, is there any guideline 